Hey everybody, there is, this is not a spring chicken, this is politics, and then there is politics. Okay, one of the things that you, well, wait, what is the president doing? Wait a minute, he's blaming the Republicans for doing such and such, and oh yeah, he does need their support, which maybe he can back them into the corner because the Republicans think, oh, we need good press. I don't know, is it that smart? Yes, to put down the people that you need the support of. Well, for now, we're going to bring old Kevin with comments on the headlines of today. And it's all over for the Republicans. Oh, yeah, they're all talking about how the, the, the Baynard has, he's only got one choice that he can do. He has to act like an adult and tell the people that elected him to go F you and, uh, and say the Tea Party, we don't want the Tea Party as members anymore. Go form your own political party because... Uh, they said, we need the love of the, Republic, of the Democratic Party because they're going to elect us to the president, they're going to elect us as president, they're going to keep elect. Well, actually, they're not because they said Maynard is on the way out, as are the 38 people that are going to give Obama his um, health care act. The House of Representatives is, okay, what oh, Lee Obama said is explain something to the people. He said, the, the, the person elected in Tuscaloosa, Mississippi, is not elected to represent the people of Haight-Ashbury in Los Angeles. The people in New York City are not elected to do the people of, of Nashville, Tennessee. Somehow the Republicans have this idea that they're elected well, when the guy, okay, when the people from Akron, Ohio elected um, Baynard, he thought he was supposed to represent San Francisco, California. Uh -huh. Now, he just simply doesn't. That's all the Republican leadership think they are. And Obama has made fools out of the Republicans again. Oh, yeah. Um, the, the guy, he, they said they're trying to figure out the logistics, but logic behind what he's doing is that he cannot win without Republican support anything, nothing. And yet he basically continues to attack the Republicans. And uh, there's no law, and said even the Democrats, you know, the pollsters say it's a losing proposition because the people that he's dependent upon are all going to get thrown out of office and they're starting to toss them out now, mm -hmm. you know, with recall elections. So what happens is he hands the Republicans the nation in 2014, which makes it even worse for him. And uh, the Democrats are, they want him to back off, but he's not going to because uh, he doubles down every time he gets in trouble. Oh. And California lawmakers reach a deal to reduce prison crowd um, crowding. Yeah, what they're going to do is if you file a criminal complaint, you're going to go to jail, not the person that committed the crime, because they figure that that's the way to do it, because uh, a law-abiding citizen will stop filing criminal charges against people if they know they're the ones that are going to be occupying the jail space, because everybody knows if you didn't have that $10 in your pocket that you spent all day long collecting cans to get, you wouldn't have been robbed by the guy that basically was watching you do all the work. Ah, and green jobs unemployment highest in the nation. Yes, it's pushing 30 percent. of okay, Green is dead. The president doesn't understand it. The California doesn't understand it. Nobody wants green and it's too expensive. I mean, we, um, we, we've been to green events where they have said, well, I can't afford to pay for this. And the guy says, well, don't worry about it because the government's going to pick up all the costs. Just order anything you want. Mm -hmm. That They haven't been back to California in a while since those statements, folks. And U.S. Senate Judiciary Committee passes a media shield law. Well, the media shield law says that uh, it, it basically, it says F you to all the people that are doing the reporting today and says legitimate news, only legitimate news people. Like, we have to have been paid for five years by a legitimate news organization to be considered legitimate news people, even though we both have degrees in journalism and we basically do, we break stories that are big time, folks. Mm-hmm. And California lawmakers pass expanded semi-automatic weapons ban. Yeah. They won't, uh, they, uh, you cannot convert um, um, a weapon into a, sing, into a uh, semi-automatic weapon now. And you also have to register all of your semi-automatic weapons under the new law because basically what they've done is they put the, they want to know who has every weapon in the state of California, which isn't going to happen. I mean, they told they have told the Democrats. I mean, they have done nothing for two weeks, but the moderates in the Senate and the House have said, "Don't do this because it's going to cost us our seats." So what do they do? The liberals are in control, so they just do whatever they choose to do. And unions unhappy with Obamacare. Well, 
we weren't, you know, they, you, you misunderstand. They weren't, they, they knew what was going to happen. What it is, is they're just unhappy with certain provisions that basically were added in afterwards and they point out, no, we have, you know, well, here's what one of the guys said, you know that we actually have a thing called uh, YouTube, which you can go back to and seeing the people saying that they, uh, they knew about all of this when the bill was passed and now they're saying that it surprised them. Uh, you know, he said, what the rule of thumb is, you know, Fleek Obama says, uh, do not say anything to anybody anymore because they might have a cell phone to capture you saying it and then you come back and haunt you. I know, and it's right there. It's like everybody's got a smartphone almost, right? right? And, and it's all over YouTube, folks. And the union's unhappy with Obamacare. I know. I know she so she it is. Head, didn't she, Flea? How about the list of firearm manufacturers fleeing gun control states keeps growing, resulting in loss in tax revenue and jobs? Oh, God. They're like, there's tens of thousands of jobs. And, and New York is chasing people out. Colorado. It caused loss of political. Uh -huh. Loss of. I mean, people lost their jobs not only because of the legislation when the business is pulled out, they totally lost their jobs as politicians because the, uh, here it is, Colorado is a red state, but it's a state full of moderate Republicans, which are actually conservative Democrats. Mm -hmm. And online sales tax bill moving ahead in the U.S. House. Yeah, uh, uh, the House of Representatives controlled by the Republicans are about ready to hand the Democrats another great victory because, oh, we want the Democrats to love us. And if we don't give them their higher taxes on things, they won't love us anymore. And labor rules to boost employment for vets and the disabled. Okay, uh, first of all, it doesn't work that way because you're not going to, you can't, okay. Under the laws, the way they have it, a person with no arms and legs could be put into controls of a nuclear reactor. Oh. Because they have to be hired. It doesn't make any difference anymore whether they can do the job physically, you still have to hire them. And Judge tosses federal permit for a South Carolina cruise terminal. Yep. The, okay, the people, the green people are getting, you know, pissed off now because what happened was they made an arrangement to, uh, for this new dock and stuff to be built using green stuff. So what happens is the uh, federal government, which, does, which is anti-business, which is why the green jobs are all being lost, killed a whole bunch of green stuff being put in. And Fed seek to legalize marijuana industry banking. Isn't that great? Um, the, uh, okay, the government does not understand. Their marijuana is going to be more expensive than the marijuana that they were being sold originally. So when you make it legal, you're not going to stop the illegal trade. You're going to increase the legal trade because they're not going to pay the taxes the government wants on it. And Japan PM pledges greater government role at Fukushima. Yeah, um, the thing is, that, I mean, I can't see the Olympic Games being held there because who, uh, we know members of the press that will not go to Japan now because of the, 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 the basically the whole crappy country is hot as hell. Oh. Yeah. And heavy rains cause flooding in Colorado. Yeah, okay, the thing is, Mother Nature does not put rain where rain is needed, it always puts it where it isn't needed. <laughs> And they're getting not a little bit, a lot of rain. Yeah. Um, fewer airline jobs, U.S. carriers, two ranks by 2.4 percent. Yeah, it's, it's, they're trying to say, okay, it's a good one. As airlines are cutting back flights, they're hiring more people. No, that's not a, that's not, but it's the same people that this morning they say, okay, housing sales are down, right? He said, consumer sentiment is down right, consumer paychecks are down right, housing sales are down right, inventory supplies are down right, um, factory orders are down right, but the market's going up. Mm -hmm. It's a phony thing. And legal marijuana, U.S. defense decision not to challenge two states' laws. Uh, the problem is that there, it is illegal. Anybody that has half a brain knows that marijuana is a hallucinogenic. You want to be on, okay, there are no laws about driving or anything under these state things. They, they simply, they, there's no way of doing it. So what happens is you can be taking legal marijuana and kill somebody and not get, uh, and, and be given a lesser charge because it's not a crime to be driving under marijuana use now. Oh, it's not? Yep. And a Monty bubble is for the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. His, you know, he says a good one. If you have no credibility to start with, you have no credibility to lose. <laughs>